me a microphone today, even though I think I don't need it. Um, uh, anyways, hi, I'm Donna Acri, uh, one of the founders of this collective, Zula Music and Arts Collective. There's a bunch of us here uh, volunteering, volunteering and uh, doing things behind the scenes. Um, anyways, I welcome you once again to Bayfront Park. Uh, for this um, installment, this is our second one of uh, the Something Else uh, Festival series, series actually. So we're combining this year our festival and our series. Obviously our uh, festival was postponed for, uh, well we all know why. Um, so we've been uh, presenting an eclectic array of music in Hamilton for nearly seven years. And uh, this year has obviously been our most challenging, um, but ironically our healthiest in terms of funding. So we'd like to express our gratitude to Canada Council for the Arts, uh, the City of Hamilton, Canadian Heritage and Ontario Arts Council for their financial support and for the belief in what we try to do every year and throughout the year. Um, we're fortunate, yay! <laughs> We're fortunate to have access to such a lovely space to help us make the transition from being mostly locked down uh, for almost six months or more now um, to at the very least a uh, temporary breather before we head back in for health concerns or for the winter, whatever uh, puts us back inside. Um, we have so far planned three events including um, what we did last week today and um, next week, the 26th, we've tentatively booked uh, the space for another three weeks after that, so the October 3rd and whatever numbers come after that. Um, but we'll just see how weather and health and restrictions uh, change because I think things are uh, changing uh, daily. So we'll just see. So keep uh, your eye on Zula Music and Arts and we'll update you. Um, but provided it feels like a reasonable thing to do, we may present some indoor events in October and continue afterwards. Uh, again, the plan is to merge the two activities, the festival and the series um, events, to behave uh, like one or the other. In, in other words, hopefully more to come in what other, whatever shape, size, or frequency we can do it. You can find all our information on uh, somethingelsefestival.com uh, and the Zula Presents Something Else page on Facebook for details, uh, upcoming events. We're also on Twitter and Instagram. Um, so today's band, trumpeter, trumpeter composer Rebecca Hennessy's Fog Brass Band, um, this will be a taste of New Orleans with plenty of grooves, sass, and grease. With <laughs> um, with our director wrote this with lots of graceful interplay um, they were going to be included in the festival uh, in June and so we're really really glad that they could come uh, down to see us uh, and play for us today so uh, everybody give a warm w welcome to Fa Re Rebecca Hennessy's Fog Brass Band Oh, yeah. 
front park, the gazebo. What is this thing called? Is this just a gazebo? <laughs> is it actually called that? Um, thank you so much. We're Fog Brass Band. And uh, we're just so thrilled to be able to play music together and for you on a, such a beautiful day. Um, that tune was called Play. And the next tune we're going to play is called... We're going to play a tune called Birds for Free. And uh, it's, it's on our record called uh, Two Calls. Um, good and bad news. We're sold to that rec the physical copy of that record. But you can buy, uh, buy it on Bandcamp if you want to support support us the best you can. You can purchase it on Bandcamp. Again, we're Rebecca Hennessy's Fog Brass Band. Um, if money's an issue, you can stream it on Spotify. We, we, we will make pennies, which we appreciate as well. Birds for free. Thank you.
fishing right now. It's called Lagoon. I saw a family fishing on uh, that side on the way in and I felt very envious because I really like fishing. And uh, I wrote this tune after Tanya Gill, this piano player over here. Give it up for Tanya Gill. She and I went fishing a bunch of years ago on Toronto Island and caught a fish. It was pretty fun. It did get away, but I'll be introducing the band as we go along. That's Tanya Gill, and we're going to celebrate her in her magnificence. Thank you. 
birthday yesterday. Ace, we have a question from the tuba player. I'm going to uh, talk a little bit while that happens. This next tune is called that was called Lagoon Night, which I already introduced. This next one is called Kings County Sheriff, and um, it's also on our record, um, available on Bandcamp or streaming. And uh, I worked with um, Jean Martin. He's a very great producer based out of Toronto from Barnyard Records to make this record, and he his um, production expertise and wizardry really shaped the sound of that record. So. I really would love it if you checked it out because I'm still very proud of it. Released in 2017. So. And then we're still figuring out some technical things, but that's okay. Enjoy the sun.
or go to TIFF. Did anyone ever log into TIFF during this time? Uh, Inconvenient Indian was one of the d featured um, documentaries um, based on the book by Thomas King, who um, I was lucky enough to collaborate with for the next uh, tune, uh, two tunes actually. Um, I wrote music to two of his poems that were, was also recently released uh, called 77 Fragments of Familiar Ruin. So this next one's called Dig Up the Stories with lyrics by Thomas King, but there will be no singing today. Are you all cozy in the sun? It's probably warmer in the sun, right? 
no complaints over here, but I'm really happy to see that the sun's out right now.
Thank you. Uh, this next tune is called Nothing Passes for Favor, and uh, this is the poem that uh, precedes the tune. This is by Thomas King. I got you. Nothing passes for favor what here. All talk is razor toothed. Take nothing from the hand that offers friendship in this place. Yeah. All promises are bruises and good suits.
thing, because I want to introduce the rest of the band. I kind of um, dropped the ball on doing it between a lot of the tunes, but um, that's Nico Dan on the drums back there. <laughs> Nico Dan! Um, that is the incredible Jay Burr on the tuba. Whoa. Tuba bass. If you haven't noticed. Look at him. Amazing, amazing dude. All of these people are amazing. Uh, really great friends. I feel very lucky that they like to play my music. Um, this is Tom Richards. Did I introduce Tom Richards yet? Look at this guy. He's amazing. He also plays uh, a sousaphone in a variety of bands, mainly the Head to Ace Brass Band, and uh, is a very great composer as well. Everyone here is composers, actually. Um, did I miss anyone? I think we're good. So we're going to take a short break, and we'll be back for another set of music. Don't go anywhere. Thanks uh, to Donna and, and Jim for having us. This is a wonderful space to be playing today, so enjoy.
tune's called Mary Lou Williams. I wrote that for Mary Lou Williams, the amazing piano player.
sing it. I'll tell you what the lyrics are, though. Dance and groove it. Don't stop moving. Take my hand and feel... No, wait. Wait, what is it? Yeah, take my hand and feel my heart beat. Oh, my love, I can't keep my eyes off of you, dear. Let's hope this never ends. It's weird to say a song, the lyrics. It, the memory bank is different when you're not singing it.
How's everyone doing? Good. Hey. Rock on. This is so fun. This is a beautiful day. Um, this next tune is called Why Are You So Sad, Booker Little. And it's on our record that you can uh, purchase on Bandcamp or streaming. Um, services. Streaming. <laughs> Screaming services. <laughs>
their last tune. You guys have been such a great audience. Um, but first, I'd like to thank Jem and Donna and all the volunteers that are part of this festival. It's such a wonderful thing you have in Hamilton. Um, this is also a wonderful park that you have in Hamilton. Wow. Um, this is Tom Richards on the trombone, everybody. Woo! Don Scott on guitar and birthday vibes. Nico Dan on the drums. Jay Burr on the tuba. Tanya Gill on the keyboard. My name's Rebecca Hennessy, and this is my band called Fog Brass Band. Thank you so much. Or that, that tune that we uh, just played was called Snag, also available on our record, and um, also about fishing. The last tune we're going to play is a new one called Remember You're Not Done. And Tanya Gill suggested that it can apply to all of you to remind us we're not done, even in spite of COVID. So here we go. 